Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Ken Domic food adventure just for you. I am in the rainy, overcast town of Bradford, Ontario, Canada at this Burger King because of you guys. In my last video, I asked who wants to see me do the Peppercorn King and a whole bunch of you, all these people, wanted me to come back and do that, so we are doing that today. We're gonna do the Peppercorn King Double. Let's order that, see if it's any good. Sure, next. Hi, what can I ask for you? Hi, I'd like to do the uh, Double Peppercorn King meal, please. Sure, what drink would you like? Uh, let's go Sprite. Yeah, anything else? And that's it, thanks. $13.90. Thank you. No All right. So one of you guys said, why don't you ever pick Sprite? So I'm doing that just for you, dude. I, I like to change it up, but my favorite beverage of choice when I do fast food is just always like a, either Pepsi or Coke. So <laughs> fantastic. Have a great day. Too, bye. bye. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's park it. All right, guys, we are parked. Let's get out the trusty steering wheel tray and start eating, shall we? Next up, we're gonna take off our seatbelt so we don't look like a noob. Eating lunch with a seatbelt on in a parking lot. All right, let's put out the placemat. Got my napkin here. Let's see what's in the bag. We got the bill and the bill came to uh, $13.89 here in Canada. It was $12.29 before our taxes, which as you know is 13% here in Ontario, Canada. There's different prices or different taxes in different uh, provinces, just like in the United States and other parts of the world. We got our straw, check. We got napkins, check. We got French fries, check. Put that there, don't fall. We got our double peppercorn king. I didn't ask for a ketchup, but she gave me three, three ketchup. And uh, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Lucky thirteen bonus fries. And of course, we're gonna. Just try and dump them back into the fry thing. Bonus fries are the best fries. I know they just fall out of the container, but I like calling them bonus fries. And I know a lot of you guys do too, because of me. Thanks for hanging out with me. Let's do a couple fries before we go in for the close up. Like usual. Let's take a quick sip. Okay, I'm gonna open this up, then we'll go in for a close up. All right, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, going into this awesome lunch here in Bradford at Burger King. Over here, we got our Sprite. Look at that. We got our golden crispy fries. Nice. And we've got that peppercorn double, or our double peppercorn king. And uh, that is a Whopper sesame seed bun. Let's go in, let's lift that lid and see what's inside without knocking it over. They uh, did spread that sauce over, so you're gonna get tons of bites before you even get to the sauce. But there's those crispy onions, lots of bacon. Way to go, Burger King Bradford. I, let's, I, I need to count, one, two, Holy schmoly, three, four, five and a half, six, six and a half bacon strips. We've got that flame broiled uh, patty. That's a Whopper patty. Uh, I always used to think the King was a smaller burger than the Whopper, but it seems to be the same size. I'm not sure what's going on. We've got a slice of cheese there, two slices of cheese. Let's do that extreme close up over here. Two slices of cheese, anything on the bottom, please be more sauce. There is more sauce on the bottom. All right, let's put this back together and start eating. We're gonna, I think we should spread some of that top lid sauce around first. Let's do that. 
All right, guys, I'm gonna put these bacon, these bacon back all over this huge Whopper patty. Yeah, for some reason, I used to think the, the King was just a smaller version of the Whopper. Mm, I guess not. I have a fork. So Burger King, you, you, lose, you lose a couple points for not spreading that sauce all over the bun. Because again, if you bit that, it, you would be taking multiple bites and not getting any sauce. So I'm going to try my best. My, my recommendation right now, ladies and gentlemen, is to ask them to double the sauce because that is not enough sauce, I don't think. It's the peppercorn king, man. You got to load up the sauce. Look. All right. So luckily I had this fork handy. All right. Let's put this lid back on. Oh, a little piece of onion crisp. And it is crispy. Okay. You got a drink. Try to sit back in your car. Reminisce about your day. Eat some french fries from Burger King. Not really enjoying the weather. But it is December here in Ontario, Canada. And there's still no snow. We have had snow several times. But then it warms up. And then it's all melted and gone. I haven't had to break up the uh, leaf, uh, the the leaf blower, the snow blower once. Very tasty fries. And going in for the double peppercorn king. Oh my goodness! I don't know why they don't call it the peppercorn whopper. Like again, I just don't understand. Um, I'll have to like look it up and see. All right, here we go. And for another large bite. It's pretty good. Like I said, it needs more sauce. This would also taste great with their onions, their tomato, their lettuce. That would definitely bump this thing up a notch. drinking game for you every time I say sauce you have to do a shot <laughs> I should open up one of the uh, one of the ketchups here let's do that at least one I'll dump it on the wrapper there we go Rapper? Who's your favorite rapper? I like Ice T. Will Smith from the 80s from the 90s. Run DMC. Two Live Crew. <laughs> Who remembers Two Live Crew? Wow. I love having these little talks with you guys. You guys are amazing. That's a lot of meat. Ooh la la. A lot of meat. And sauce. It's not a lot of sauce. That was two shots, by the way. So it's kind of dry because there's not a lot of sauce. So we're going to add some ketchup to this peppercorn king again i'm not getting a whole lot of peppercorn flavor which is you know it's called the peppercorn king it needs to be more peppercorn there we go now i've sauced it up a bit more unfortunately you know i i guess if i was eating in the restaurant i'd go ask them for another thing of sauce Maybe we should do that. So the ketchup is definitely helping moisten this up a little bit, but I think I'm right. I think we should just go zip in there real quick like, and uh, grab ourselves 
a thing of peppercorn sauce and then dump that on the top lid and see if we're gonna get some more of that peppercorn flavor because at this moment, there's not enough sauce. Did you hear me? All right, let's put this over here. You guys, how many times has he said sauce? He, he's just obsessed with sauce. But I'm trying to make sure you guys understand that if you order this, it's not gonna taste good without extra sauce on it. They just didn't put enough. All right, let's just get the wallet away for a minute and uh, we'll grab our hat, our mask, and let's go in there and grab some more sauce. Hi, I just went to the drive-thru. I was wondering if I could get another thing of sauce, uh, peppercorn sauce. Yeah, this wasn't off on the burger. Like you guys put peppercorn sauce on the top and the yeah, bottom. But we don't have any stuffing. We have enough containers, so we're gonna. Yeah, just give it to me in a little. Okay. That'd be great. How you doing, buddy? All right, how you doing? That's good. Yeah, that's perfect. Thank you very much, guys. Have a good day. Eh? Appreciate it. We got the sauce. Let's eat. back in the car ladies and gentlemen yeah this uh bradford uh, burger king location loves me because i do most of my burger king reviews here used to have to go all the way up to barry and that was the way it was but now i just uh come down to bradford much closer and uh they love the fact that i'm always pimping them out all right let's put this over here i'm gonna scrape off some of that ketchup because i think the ketchup's kind of killing it and uh he did give me like a lot of peppercorn sauce um let's put that down there got my fork still again i'm gonna scrape off some of this ketchup because again it's just not good on the burger so so ketchup is a no-no don't do it don't do it okay so now we're gonna put a large scoop so they don't have uh, packages. Okay, Burger King, this, this is my recommendation to you. Here we go. This, this is what you need to do. This is what you need to do. So this is the bottom, this is the bottom bun or bottom patty. That's how much peppercorn sauce you need to put on the bottom. Then you flip it over, take off our bacon lid and uh, we are gonna sauce it up on this lid ah come on ken get it together buddy all the, the patties are sliding apart there we go oh yeah yep that's how much sauce it needs because it is a double patty especially the double patty part let's just do a little quick taste test of the peppercorn sauce mmm very nice it's got a nice little kick to it. Burger King, you did a really good job on the sauce. Okay, let's put this top lid back on. It is gonna be really slippery now and gushy, but oh my gosh, it is leaking out. That's the way we want it. That's the way we want it. Let's take a bite of that and see if it's any good, if it's any better. much better i'm glad we did that holy cow that's what we want look at that we want a messy face we got a good tasty sauce on your burger We want a good peppery bite to have that seasoning. Mm. 
Oh, so much better. So much better. Oh. Mm. I am loving this to pieces. Now that we've improved it. Now that we've built it the way it should have been built. So again, my recommendation is uh, uh, Burger King Bradford. Just do a, a, you know, a couple circles on the top, a couple circles on the bottom, and your customers will be as happy as me. Bring a bib. Because it's crazy drippy, but tasty. We might get a little drip off the bottom here. That is definitely 10 times better with the double sauce, probably triple sauce that I put on, and that crunchy bacon, processed cheese, making it all slippery between the between the patties. Ooh la la. You know what I'm talking about. And that toasted Whopper bun. That was phenomenal. Great tasting burger, but again, my favorite thing at Burger King is a Whopper, straight up Whopper with all the toppings. Don't mess with the Whopper ever. But this is good to try. Big chunk of meat fell out. Ooh la la. Burger King Bradford, you guys are rocking it with the bacon. Thanks for putting so much bacon on there. But again, just double the sauce and uh, everybody will be super happy. All right, guys, I am loving this double peppercorn king burger so much i'm gonna have to give it a one o'clock in the morning shout out bye to all you amazing men and women out there who love to watch my videos at one o'clock in the morning we don't know why you do but you do this next saucy bite is just for you cheers mm -hmm. yeah we have a winner i'm gonna drag it through all the sauce that fell out of it. There we go. Last bite. Mmm. All right, guys, we are all done. Well, there you go. Two points for Ken. All right, guys, on my rating scale, I'm gonna have to give the Burger King Double Peppercorn King a would recommend but it definitely goes up to a go out and get it now if you get the right amount of sauce on it. Uh, so make sure you ask for double, possibly triple sauce. They put the right amount of bacon on it, the right amount of cheese, the double patty was fine. I would normally probably go for a single, but I wanted to overdo it just for you guys. And of course that toasted Whopper bun was phenomenal. Way to go Burger King. Once again, guys, I'd like to thank every single one of my viewers and subscribers for commenting and liking. And of course, all my channel members, you guys are amazing. Thank you very much for all your support. And of course, all my supporters over on Patreon. You guys rock. And once again, if you wanna show your support for me, doing these videos just for you, hit it with a thumbs up, ding, 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 ding. But if you're still hungry for more, check out that amazing playlist I dumped down over there and we'll see you over there. Bring your hunger. <laughs>